Well, new tonight at six, we saw many places shut down during the COVID-19 pandemic. However, one church decided they weren't going to let that happen and found a creative way to keep services going. Channel 3's Angela Kim shows us how. Behind me, this looks like a normal parking lot, but it's actually an opportunity that South Cleveland Church of God has used during the COVID-19 pandemic to give the most back on these Sunday mornings. <laughs> This has been a year that no pastor was ever trained for. Pastor Edwin Lipsy traded his typical spot at the pulpit for the parking lot. We meet here in our ministry center parking lot uh, and have an outside church service uh, for people who just aren't quite comfortable uh, and ready to come back in and get around other people. This drive-in service began about three weeks after the pandemic began and resulted in hundreds of people attending. We average about 150 people in the parking lot service. One attendee, Rayful Ware, says the adjustment was a smooth process for him and his wife during the pandemic. He has uh, adjusted very well to being outside and uh, to carry on the message for us. He says it has been the perfect alternative for anyone with health conditions. Because of our health issues, uh, it, it's better for us to, you know, to to have an opportunity to come to a, to a place like this to be able to you know, continue our worship. Lipsy added it hasn't just been a new opportunity for the community, but also a time where the church has made history in both attendance and fundraising for mission trips. And then also people who are not here are hearing us on 104.1. So we've had lots of people from the community connect with us uh, that we were not connected with before. Lipsy hopes to continue connecting with as many people as possible, despite the ups and downs that 2021 may bring. I'm expecting 200 cars in my parking lot service for Easter morning. Now these drive-in services happen every Sunday at 9.30 a.m. and there are also special plans in the works for an Easter service as well. Reporting in Cleveland, Angela Kim, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.